What's up everybody? Welcome back to Pokemon Black. Last episode we defeated the gym leader Elisa, whatever her name is. And today we're going to continue on with our journey. But first, we're gonna go look for some items that was left by a comment by somebody. I think it was Roy Boy. One, two, three or something like that. Um sorry if I don't get your name right. But one of the houses, if you talk to an old woman or a woman, they'll give you a soothing bell which would help me which will help me um evolve my rick flair so let's i think it's this lady uh no this guy okay that's a sunstone but um oh my your sundial seems to like you that's nice to see it makes me want to give you this all right there we go we got a sooth bell all right so i'm gonna give this to rick flair to hold um pretty much uh, this will pretty much cause Rick. F He's dead. This will pretty much give Rick Flair the opportunity to uh, evolve a little bit faster because um, he evolves with friendliness, and it'll be kind of hard if it'll be harder if he doesn't have the thing. He doesn't have the item on, so that's why I'm gonna give him the Sooth Belt because it's just perfect for him. I probably leave it on him. Um. Okay, well, I'll leave it on him until he evolves. That way I could just, like, have it in my party or something. I don't know. All right, so let's heal up our Pokemon and let's get our stuff. All right, I'm thinking if I should buy some equipment. I probably don't have enough money to buy a lot of stuff, but I guess it'll do. And where's the bell? All right. So I'm going to give the suit belt to Ric Flair. And we're gonna start leaving town already. Actually, let me show off what the Pokemon musical is. I know it's some it's side stuff, but she not what? Wasn't she here? Oh, okay. I don't know if you guys saw. Oh, there she is. I don't know if you guys saw Bianca right here. Just talking about Pokemon musical. Oh, Ruben, are you interested in musicals? Then let's go in together. Oh, good. Dang it. I, didn't, I shouldn't have come here. Ah, <sighs> amazing, isn't it? That's not. Hey, you two, how do you do? I'm the owner of this theater. Pleasure to meet you. I really don't care. Well, I must say that you two seem like a phenomenal trainer. So what do we do here? Use props to make your Pokemon fashionable and glamorous? Do you want to join in and play dress up? To get you started, here's a prop case. Alright, looks like we're getting an HM key item or whatever. Okay, so we're getting all this stuff. Alright, so we're gonna pick a Pokemon. Who's the cutest Pokemon in here? Cheeto, you're the cutest Pokemon in here. Alright. So, Cheeto's gonna be our guinea pig here. So, we're gonna put some stuff on her. Alright. So, what, what should we give Cheeto? Cheeto's a spicy salsa person. So, I'm, I'm gonna give her some maracas to play with. And I'm gonna... I'm gonna give her uh, some sunglasses. Yeah, looks good. Alright, what else can Cheeto wear? You know, Cheeto, you should put on, you should put on this hula dress. Let's see. Alright, there you go. I think that's okay. Is that okay? Alright, that's okay. Alright, so with that, we are going to see what Cheeto can do. Alright, well, the two of you did a fantastic job coordinating everything. Utterly charming. If you have a Pokemon who can play dress up, you can participate in the Pokemon musical. Would you like to please join us? The reception is going to explain everything. Let us say a brief farewell. I eagerly anticipate your whatevers. So, yeah, that's that guy. Oh, I didn't know what to do. Doing the musical would be totally cool, but there's other stuff I want to do. Okay, that's it. I made up my mind. I'm going to see the sights in Nambasa. See you, Ruben. Alright, I'm pretty sure this shit is optional and I don't want to do this at the moment. I'll probably do this later. Oh, and her dad is here. God dang it. What do you want? Daddy? What are you doing here? Netflix and chilling daughter. I am with my other lady friend. And bye-bye. No way! I'm going to keep traveling with Ruben and my Pokemon. Hey, hey, hey. I'm going by myself, man. I don't, I don't want you with me. You're kind of annoying. Alright, so yeah, she's pretty much arguing with your daddy. Oh god. Oh look, it's Elisa. Hey, who do you think you are? This is a family matter. My name is Elisa. I am this town's gym leader and I also happen to be a model. Yeah, you're kind of a model. Oh, you know, there are many people in this world. There are people's way of thinking may be completely different from yours. Sometimes this means you may get hurt. Of course, that's exactly right. I... It's, it's because I'm worried about that. But it's important to keep trying to learn about the differences between yourself and others. 
to learn that being different is okay. And you shouldn't worry. Trainers always have Pokemon at their side. People are wonderful. It's not only how cute they can be, but also how much you can depend on them. Please. I want... I know there's going to be painful stuff like you're worrying about. I don't really. I get it. But like, listen, there'll be tons of nice people too. Know what else? Since I've been traveling with Pokemon, I've already gotten to tougher. And so can you let me go, Dad, please? Please, puppy! Hmm. I guess. I mean, if I want... We want you to continue your journey. Your selfishness in your part, wanting to stop you, is selfishness on mine. I'm surprised I'm the childish one at my age. This gym leader's comments help me wake up. Wake up, America! The Illuminati's coming to get you! Alright, so hopefully we're done with that. Papa! Papa CJ! Let's go, my nigga! Alright, so she's gonna go Route 5 for some reason. Um, she's so cool. Ha, I totally want to be a cool woman like Alessa. Um, I wonder if I'll get there. Oh, well, before that, I guess I need to discover what I really want to do. See you later, Ruby. Same here, though. I don't know what I'm going to do in life or the career. But anyways, enough of pernal, uh, pernal soul. <laughs> personal shit. Let's head off out of here, because I really don't want to be here. But, hey, what's nice? What's good, son? Oh! Hey! Ruben, stop! You've got a bolt badge, and I've got a bolt badge. Let's tease who's stronger, you or me. Okay. Sharon, we already established this 42 times. You are probably going to be losing to me every time. Um, I beat you since the beginning. I can't believe I lost to Bianca at the beginning. Alright, so he's going to go off as Leopard. This is a terrible move on my part because I have nothing to kill this thing. So I'm just going to go to El Jefe. And I hit my game control. And El Jefe is going to pretty much just one hit KO this thing. And why would you fake out, man? I am not doing anything. Alright. Oh, you want to go for the torment? Come on, man. Alright, alright. Razor Shell should pretty much just to kill this thing. No? Yeah? Okay. Alright. You want to see something? Oh, okay. Alright. You want to see this? Super effective? Overkill? You want to see this? Come on. Come on. Eat my ass. Okay. <laughs> Look at all those EXP. Alright. Servine. Now, I'm gonna switch into Cheeto, definitely. Because Cheeto just, like, completely wrecks a Servine. Um, shouldn't be a very hard fight at all, honestly. Flame Burst is pretty much a one-hit KO. S uh, stab everything, you know, blah, blah. You're dead. Alright. I think it's an Impampor. It's the water thing. Um, do we have any grass moves? That's the thing. Uh, Ric Flair, you can do this. Alright. Panport is... Okay. I think Hard Stamp should just do everything. You can make him flinch? Ah, oh, no flinch. Although I think Skull is gonna burn. No, it didn't. Okay, good. Alright, Hard Stomp, please make him flinch. Yes, and I think we're good, guys. We beat Sharon again. Oh, lamey. Oh, Tranquil. What the hell's Tranquil? Oh, it's that Pokemon. Okay. Mmm. What do I do here? Okay. I'll go into Nixon. Just for, uh, safe purposes. You know, stuff. Okay. I'm gonna go for Crunch. Probably not gonna do much. Oh, it does a lot. Oh, crap. Okay. Air Cutter. Alright. Let's see. And he's going for the Detect. What a lame. Okay. Crunch? Anything? No? Okay. There we go. Alright. So we pretty much beat Sharon. Easy. And Moxie is so good. Jesus. Okay. So we got it. Yay! Alright, why? Why can't I defeat you? It's because you're bad. Get good. Oh, you two are friends. That's nice. You're helping each other by getting better at competing. Okay, let's go. Oh. Okay. We have people here. Oh, why is it an Alessa? Ooh, who's this guy? Art festival is grand. Life should be enjoyed. Who's this man? I'm gonna give him a voice, guys. Hold on. This is Elder, the Unova region's champion. Champion? Why would the champion be goofing off in a place like this? I heard that remark. You're just quite a judgmental young person. Are you not? My name is Elder. I am the Unova Pokemon League's champion. Pleased to make your acquaintance. For your information, 
I am not going off. I am on a voyage. I know every corner of Unova. Huh, and I'm Sharon from New Town. My goal as a trainer is to become the champion. Hmm. Traveling with a goal in mind is a commendable thing. And what do you plan to do after becoming the champion? I don't know, man. Well, what else is there? The other becomes stronger. The strongest trainer, that's the champion. Hmm, becoming stronger. Becoming stronger, you say. Is that alone enough a goal? Hmm. It's not that I'm trying to say your way of thinking is wrong. In my travels, I've helped so many people learn to love Pokemon. It's important, too, if you play with those children, you might gain more in understanding. Will you two have a Pokemon battle with those two? Hey, you two, come here for a moment. All right. Honestly, we're gonna... Woo! We're getting a free health care! Why can't this happen in America? Okay. Woo! All right, we're gonna go against preschooler Billy and Sarah. They're gonna send out their herd ears. Bark, bark. Oh, that's so adorable. Okay, so Ric Flair and Leopard are gonna team up. Woo! All right. Okay. I see your strats. Ah, dang it. All right, so our attack has been lowered, but hey, whatever. All right, going for that fake out was super nice. Okay. Uh, we're gonna. Oh, I should. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna switch out. Uh. <laughs> Goodbye. Um. Yeah, I love it. Uh, you you do your thing, man. I'm I'm out of I'm out of here, man. Oh, fuck fuck that shit. Uh, why would you go? F okay, I don't know. Isn't pursuit the move where someone's gonna switch out? It's stronger. I have no idea. Okay, so revenge should probably kill this thing. Come on, revenge, do a thing, do a thing. What? Why work up? All right, I guess that's something. Oh, lovely Rita, Rita maid. Where have I been without you? Nice. Alefa gets all this EXP, baby. All right, and so does Ric Flair. All right, and I think this herd here is dead. Let's see if he even gets a chance to- oh wow, he didn't attack me. Oh, that's a pretty nice strategy you got there. It'd be a shame if I killed you with my revenge. And he's dead! Alright. Pretty easy. So we beat Preschool Sarah and Preschooler Billy. My Pokemon is so cute! My Pokemon listened to what I said and fought for me. Yay. Oh no. Yay. Nicely done. You didn't win, but that was a good battle. Your Pokemon <laughs> looked like they were having fun. Pretty sure Pokemon are dead. I mean, like you pursue strength, why are there also people who are just happy with just Pokemon? There are many different people who have many different answers. When it comes to what a champion should be, you and I holding different views, but so be it. Just give it some thought. Let's roll. Drift build drawbridge is just ahead. Alright, Sharon, are you gonna heal my Pokemon? Nah. Uh, can you heal my Pokemon, buddy? Hey, got on. Ah, uh, I don't heal. Alright. Alright, we're gonna battle Mr. John Lennon here. Oh, I'm fiercely my battle song. Battle fiercely my Pokemon. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You're challenged by musician John Lennon. I'm pretty sure this is John Lennon, anyways. Just looks like him. Alright, he has got a Britzel. How do we defeat a Britzel? We, we go with Nixon and he does stuff. Whoa. Alright. Nixon just sand tuned this guy. <laughs> watch this, guys. Watch this being insta kill. Oh my goodness. And with Moxie. Moxie, dude. Oh my goodness. Alright. Dude, come on. Come on. Oh my god. Okay. I could just say this right now. Nixon is probably going to be our powerhouse. If he gets one hit KOs, he's pretty much one hit of KOing everybody with sweeps. Jesus. Alright. That was good. That's a rhythm to attacking and defending. I think ours got thrown off. Alright, Mr. Lennon. I'm battling you. I came to understand. You're the best. Here, this is for you. I got an electric guitar. Nice. Go to Mythic Theater. Cooler than cool. Alright. I think being able to play today to do. Oh, that's pretty neat. Okay. Uh, let's see, I think we're gonna have a double battle, so I'm gonna switch Nixon to the front. And... Is it people? No? Okay. Alright. Street Performers! 
Turn around, it's, it's my turn. Oh boy. Dancer Brian. Brian! <laughs> my binky. Alright. Um, let's see, Nixon, just go for a Sand Tomb. I think this is insta kill. This thing is poor defense. Yep. Alright. Darumaka! More like Daru dead. That was a terrible pun. Sue me. Alright, so he's got two of these. Alright, that's pretty cool. Alright, Darumaka! Let's see, Sand Tomb should just one hit KO easily because of Moxie and Stab. So, good day, sunshine. Alright, that was good. Ooh, nice. Alright, all these level ups. Dance a man. <laughs> My bean. Alright. Whoa! Oh, uh, Nixon is evolving. Thank you, Brian. Brian. <laughs> Alright, so Nixon is becoming his second evolution. Um, I forgot he actually evolved at level uh, 29, I think he is. I wasn't paying attention. Sorry about that. But yeah, he's evolving into a... Let's see what this is. You're a Nixon evolved into a Krokorok. Krokorok. Alright. So we got our little Krokorok, and that's Nido. Second evolution of the day. Ah, oh, this way. Okay. Now contact him. Alright, let's see what you gotta say, buddy. Got a phone call and shit. Okay, it's me, Alessa. Please lower the drawbridge. I have a couple trainers here who want to challenge you. Okay, thanks. Now watch this. Oh, we're gonna see some cutscenes. Yo, hype. This is pretty hype. Hey, yo, bruh. Yeah. All right. So we're getting the draw bridges. All right. I have a TV gig, so I've got to go. The gym leader of the next town should make take some time getting used to. Do your best, both of you. All right, that's good to hear. Nice to see you. All right. What, a, what I am as a trainer, I prove right by getting stronger and winning in battle. Even against the champion. It's nice to hear, buddy. All right. So what we're going to do now is that we're going to go on our bicycle. doo doo doo, -doo. All right. Hopefully we don't have the battle trainers here because no, I don't want to battle people. Because I just, I just got out, man. That's so nice. This, this place... Whoa. Okay, I don't, I don't think people battle you here, but... Hey, this place is really peaceful, and we are in the most amazing... Oh, what did I do? Okay, sorry about that. Alright, this place has probably the best music in the game, honestly. Alright, bridges are amazing, because they're a symbol of connecting the world, but they say the guy Route 5 is just the same thing, isn't he? Um, I guess he is. Alright, so let's find the Pokemon Center so we can save and heal. Alright. Let's see... Oh, Sharon's here. Okay. Hmm. So you're the trainers Lisa was talking about, huh? I'm Clay. I'm the gym leader around here. Don't be expecting a welcome now. Cause when we lowered that bridge, the Team Plasma guys we caught done escaped in all the ruckus. What a bother. We're grateful that you lowered the bridge, but how was that our fault? You can say whatever you want. But that's the important thing is that y'all showed up when the plasma escaped. Maybe it's a little heavy-handed, but I know how to start looking for the Team Plasma, too. You're both talented trainers, aren't you? Tell you what, if you are fine with Team Plasma, I'll let you challenge my gym. Life's all about give and take. Well, I suppose that's fair, but uh, really, would we have to look for Team Plasma if you're not even had into ass? I mean, I can get stronger while beating some bothersome bunch. Ruben, y'all go hot ahead. Alright, you do that, man. Anyways, guys, I'm going to end off the episode up here. Uh, next time on Pokemon Black, we are going to go look for Team Plasma. See you guys next time. Peace.